Plus with the Idaho News 6 forecast. Welcome back, Idaho. I'm Sophia Cruz. Now, guess who's coming to town today? If you're thinking Beyonce or Taylor Swift, well, I've got some news for you because we've just only got a cold front running through and some precipitation. Sorry to be the bearer, bad news, but we have precipitation rolling over into this morning's commute with a temperature of 37. So we're staying above freezing. That's the bright side of this. And then hopefully while you're on your way home, you'll notice that the sun is going to start to peak out. Now this would be really good because we haven't seen the sun in days, it feels like. Now we're also warming up to about 40 too, so this will be a fairly well for the valley today. Precipitation isn't going to be much if you're in the Treasure Valley and notice while you're traveling through I-84, this is where primarily most of it will be and then it'll start to push its way east. So we're not getting much precipitation, about less than a tenth, maybe even a quarter, but it will still be prevalent and that'll keep the roads wet and slick throughout the day. Now looking at snow, what we're bringing along with this front that's coming through is some snow, and but it's really going to favor most the mountains. However, if you're in any of these areas, you're going to accumulate probably between one to two inches at most. And then mixed with that precipitation coming in, that is where you'll see roads be fairly slick and wet. Luckily for most areas, we're staying above freezing, which means that we shouldn't see much freezing rain on the roads if we do get any, but that is a hazard that you should be known about. Now, the heavier parts of the system will also see this follow. So if you have heavier rain showers mixed with the snow pellets, that's when we see that hazard for freezing rain. In the Treasure Valley, though, we dry out by the afternoon with temperatures remaining in 44. I guess 44 is our lucky number today. We're saying in the mid 40s. Then in the Magic Valley, we're seeing that precipitation roll through throughout the day. And like I said, it's favoring the east. So it's heading towards the east parts of Idaho currently. And we're also seeing temperatures fairly dry. Now, they also may get a bit of snow mixed with rain, but we're staying above that 32 mostly for the entire day. So as long as we don't dip below, we should be okay. But be mindful of those roads still if you're traveling about the area. Now looking at the west and east central mountains, west central mountains are going to see the snow fall mostly during the daytime, and then it'll be out by lunch. I'll also be seeing a fairly dry weather pattern as we go on to the later parts of the day. So this is good. We're staying dry mostly today in the afternoon, but in the morning is when we're seeing this roll through. Now, as I said, this is really going to favor the East Central Mountains. So this is Friday, one in the morning, so we should be dry overnight on Friday, but we're just seeing that precipitation really just roll through the area. Like I said, we're not getting Beyonce or Taylor Swift coming into town, but we are getting this cold front. Luckily, though, we do warm up by the weekend, so we're staying in 44 and then we get 47 on Saturday. But with that, we're seeing some more precipitation. Hopefully we try to stay in this dry pattern for at least three days and get more sunshine. But Wednesday, we're also expecting some more. Have a good Thursday commute.